the oceans are the big guy. The oceans control everything. And the oceans now are slowly changing. And that is the danger we face today. The first photographs I shot on assignment for National Geographic, 1960, we went out to Carey's Fort Reef and it was pristine, it was beautiful. I took a total of seven or eight frames and butted them together and this is what they ended up with. And this one I came back in 1989 in virtually the same spot. The beautiful barrier reef forest went to hell. Jerry, that was 23 years ago. What's it look like now? You want to go out there and see? If we put carbon dioxide into the atmosphere, about half of it comes out very, very quickly. It's absorbed by the oceans. And when that happens, it forms carbonic acid. So the whole ocean of the world is acidifying. This is the same spot and that's what's left of it out there. We now know CO2 isn't just acidifying the waters, it's also warming the atmosphere, which is warming the waters. Coral reefs are particularly vulnerable to this increased temperature and increased corrosiveness. We've had coral reefs for many millions of years and they're one of the most life-filled places on the whole planet. If we lose the coral, we lose about 25% of the entire biodiversity of the oceans. Now I'm looking around and saying, well, Jesus, it's not so far off from what happened 65 million years ago. The last great mass extinction was when the dinosaurs came to an end. But there's been five of them, and they've had different causes, but there's been one common factor in all, the massive increase in carbon dioxide. The great fear is that it's all about to happen again. The sea fan is gone. This is all shot and gone. Is anything alive in the Palmata in here? Is any of that alive? It's all gone. Anyway, it's all dead. In the process of doing things that we consider to be really ordinary, like you know, driving our kids to a soccer game, we're doing something that is a source of a lot, a lot of problems. When the oceans start dying like that, the planet can't function as it used to function. That is a mass extinction.